I know this video is a little different to my normal videos. It's less of a um, tutorial on like an effect or anything. It's more of a little review of a pack that I've um, got. And this video it will be sponsored. Uh, and there's links in the description to the pack that I'll be showcasing in this video. The first link in the description gives you access to this pack specifically. Whereas the second link gives you access to an array of packs. Literally loads of packs on a recurring uh, monthly payment basis. So yeah, just go down in the description. Have a look at the um, links and see which one uh, you know you want to use. And yeah, but yeah, let's get into it. So to actually get the pack into Premiere Pro, it's actually super easy. You just want to come over to the RAW file that you just downloaded. You want to right click and then extract it. And then once you've extracted it, you just want to come to the thing that says titles and then the thing that says Tut P Morg files. You can see they're all in there. All you want to do is you want to right click on this. You want to copy it. So you just want to search up this in your search bar and then click on the thing here. Then you want to come down to Adobe and you want to come down to common and you want to come down to motion graphics templates, double click on it. And then you just want to place this file in here. So just uh, copy and paste it because you've already, you should have already copied it from the other one. Just paste it in and then you, it should appear in here. And once you've done that, and yeah, once you put it in there, you should be done. And you can go onto Premiere Pro and it should all appear there. Finish all of that and you've got all of your effects in the right folders, uh, all the templates in the motion graphics folder, which is where they should be. It's super easy. You just open up Premiere and you can just go to the effects tab. You can actually go to most of these tabs, but basically anything other than the assembly tab. And then you just want to wait for it. And then you just want to come over to the essential graphics right here. And you just want to go to the my templates and then search and search. Just search TUTP just like that and press enter. And we'll come up with all of the different templates that you've just downloaded. Now you can search by um, by category. So you, for example, you've got the broadcast ones. And if I scroll down, there's cartoon ones. And then if I scroll down again, you'll see kinetic and minimal like there's so many different ones there's literally loads look how many minimal ones there are there's modern there's cartoon as well there's retro there's loads of different ones slice literally so many vintage wedding literally everything anything you could want there's probably something here so just literally keep you can keep looking for loads of different things it's super easy to use yeah it's super easy like you can literally just drag any single one on i'm going to drag this one on just randomly literally any single one it'll just come straight onto the screen yeah all you have to do is drag it on just like this and you can literally see that it works perfectly the first time. You just want to drag it to where you want on your clip. And then obviously you don't want it to say that because, you know, I mean, maybe you do want it to say that, but the odds are you're going to want to change it. So it's really easy. You just want to come off of the browse. You just want to go to edit instead. And you can literally customize so many things. So if I uh, scroll out just to show you, you can change the duration just like this. Maybe I want it to be 30 seconds. So after 30 seconds, it'll end. And then you can obviously cut your clip down to 30 seconds. I'll probably have it uh, a lot shorter though. Let's go, let's go for about five seconds, I reckon. So if I click on this and then go to edit, five seconds long, super easy. And then I'll come down to the five second mark and I'll just shorten the clip to five seconds. There you go. And you can see that it starts and ends exactly at five seconds, just like that. Super easy. And the other thing you can do is you can obviously change the text to, sh to change the text on the different things. Super easy. I'm just going to come to a bit where I can see all the text just like this. Okay, that's better. So now what I'm going to do is super easy. You just want to click on it. You want to go to the text type tool and you just want to click on the text here. You can change it to whatever you want. So I can change it to um, subscribe, which you should do. You should definitely subscribe to the channel. <laughs> and I could I could change uh, this to, you know, my name. I could do anything. And then I'll, I'll leave that. I don't, really, don't really need to change that. But yeah, look, you can see it works perfectly with all, with all the names changing and everything. It works completely fine. And you can also, if you don't like the colors, really easily change the color just by coming down to the thing down here that says color controls. You can see all the different shapes here have color have colors assigned to them. And you can just play around with all the colors until you like it. You might want to change this color from blue. You might want to do green. Literally, you can do anything. You might even want to completely change the colors you might want to keep one bit the same and change another bit it's so easy to change it i'm going to leave it how it is just for now but it's so easy to change it you can change the sizes if you want it to be longer you can make it longer but obviously you're going to want to um change it all to you know make it the same you might want to also change the text as well when you do that but yeah it's super easy you can change pretty much everything you can remove the background so that you can put something under it for example i'll just uh quickly grab a solid to put under it just to show that you can um make the background so i'll just get a red solid just so that you can see that when you um once you drag this on if i just put this above and drag this below it you can see that there is a background behind it and if i click on this and go back to the uh, effects here so you can see once i come back to the effects here you can see that i can uh, take off the background and there's n no background here but i can then 
click remove background and it removes the background from this and you can put whatever you want under it obviously with me since my channels are pretty fortnite orientated for the people who are watching for the fortnite stuff there's loads of things here for like content videos and stuff loads of sort of titles like that but this is this is less about like the fortnite style itself this is more about just general titles and stuff that you can use for literally any video but yeah obviously obviously it is useful for everyone it's probably more useful for people who want to make a variety of content but for example if i search up back search back up this i'll probably i'll be able to find a nicer one the minimal ones are probably the best um the minimal ones are good in my opinion because they're a lot more vague so it, it's not like um it's not like it fits into a style you can sort of fit it into your style for example this one here right here could be used on any video because of the instagram thing you could use this as your as your instagram thing you can change up the colors remove the background if you want and have it pop up in the corner as an instagram you know as a lower third for your instagram or something like that it literally there's so many different things you can do with it you can i can change this to you know my instagram or whatever just like that and i can change this to say because or and i can change this as a, you know like tutorial youtuber you know that sort of thing and you can see that it's it's put, works perfectly i can change it all you can easily put it in the corner instead of like the middle if you want this to pop up at like the lower corner as like your instagram thing you just want to drag the x over to the left and then drag the y over to the right and it'll bring it down there you go look that's in the bottom corner and you would have it play you'd have a video playing under it and as you can see it all pops up just like that really perfect really well done it's literally super easy it's really easy to use really easy to change the stuff on it and you can change all the colors change the scale if you want it to be bigger or smaller you know make it make it large you, literally so many different things you can do with it make it bigger just in general you know loads loads of stuff you can do with it i'll show you a, a couple more different templates for example i'll just drag this one and it looks like a pretty sort of simplistic one that you could use anywhere but yeah you can see this one's like really simple one a really easy one you could use this quite easily for the people who are watching from you know my more fortnite related tutorials you can use this pretty easily for a um you know for an identity sort of thing you could change that to your name and have that come in i think that would look nice the way that it sort of comes in really simply and you can obviously change the colors this is literally a premiere pro preset super easy to use just come over here you can edit you know click on this change the duration change the colors change the font if you want to change the font and you can change the text as well to make it wider it's literally super easy change all these colors obviously you can remove the background you want to do that if you're putting this on your you know clips but yeah i i think this would be a really i think this would be a really simple and really nice way to put an um, identity on your um fortnite sort of related videos if that's what you're making but yeah all together this pack has literally tons and tons of fonts ha has so many and yeah you can just have a play around with it if you want i'll leave a link in the description this this video is sponsored so i did uh get this to review especially to review so yeah just go down have a look at the links in the description if you want to go and get it and yeah thanks for watching i'll see you in the next one so yeah just go down have a look at the links in the description if you want to go and get it and yeah thanks for watching i'll see you in the next one